Let me, let me just show you to you really quickly. I throw a fireball, and I strike right when that fireball hits. If you press a button, you're gonna right. get hit. Right. It's exactly that. Right, basically. and that's yeah. what, and that's the th that's something that you have to, um, you have to start thinking about when you do that to your opponents, right? And and mess with it. So now. I'm gonna, I told you, right? So when you block the fireball, I'm positive, right? So let's do this again. Now I get to go and throw you, right? Now it's, now it's throw, right? Because now you're scaring him because now he, he's gonna press a button. Right. So what, so, so yeah, so you are making it a mix yes. up. If you make him block this, you gotta make it feel it. And this gives you that. And what did we talk about earlier in the session, right? If I get to do this, I get to do that. I get to do this, I can and do it again, right? Mm -hmm. That's the loop that you want to get to, right? As long as you get to do this at max range, you get to do this. And when you get to do that, you get to do crouching jab, crouching middle kick fire, right. right? So I want you to do that. I want you to do forward middle punch, but that's too close, right? You want to do it at max range. Forward middle punch, forward roundhouse, crouchy jab, crouchy middle kick, fireball, forward roundhouse. Okay? Alright, so go ahead. Too close. It's too close? But yeah. yeah, you were too close on that. That forward roundhouse has to be. Yeah, there you go. That forward middle punch has to be pretty. At max range, there you go. Then forward roundhouse. Yep. Ah. Then fireball. Ah. You're yep. getting my charge up, okay, so. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it's a little hard to do it. There you go. And remember, light fire yeah, all the time, right? Yeah, light So, so. Sometimes that crouching middle kick won't hit. And that's when you get to mix it up. Then you get to do a dash throw. Then you get to get him frustrated. Then you get to, you know, then he'll start counter hitting. And then, right when that counter hit, you go into legs, you get the pressure, and you stay on him. And you pressure him, right? right? Weedy, middle punch, four roundhouse, you know, and and you just stay here. You don't kind of, you don't really commit to anything. When I mean by commit, you don't go into like this, or you don't go into like this and into fireball or ex legs. Don't commit to anything. You don't have to do anything. You just sit there and you wait for the jump. That's all I'm waiting for. For you to jump. You don't jump. Four roundhouse again. So the jump or the and negative two. Yes. So I'll wait. Yeah, I'll just wait. And if you dash at me, crouching jab. So there is no, yeah, see, like, there's no way you're gonna get out and of it. And if they keep blocking throw, right? You can do this, or you can go for throw, right? But you wanna maximize your dash into throw. So what I do is I do the same thing, right? And then throw, right? The reason why you don't wanna do it too close is because they have more time. They're, 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 you when win. the closer you are, the more um, jittery a person is. Meaning, like the, the the higher chance they're gonna press the uh -huh. button, right? So if I'm at if I'm at a distance, am I am I am, am I like when I get at a far away distance, um, then I they're not gonna think about oh am I gonna get thrown because I'm far, but I'm far enough to where a dash will just reach them and then a throw comes comes out, right? Right. 